Didn't think I'd have to make this update so uh, at all. Um, now, as Shuby has mentioned, my Discord account has been hacked. This is not from clicking suspicious links. That's not the only way you get hacked. Uh, I didn't want to have to put out a message, but apparently you morons don't understand that there's other ways to be hacked. Uh, what happened was my Discord is connected to an old email account that I made in high school um, that I don't use anymore. So it's an email account I've long since stopped using. Uh, and it's a Microsoft email account uh, from the Hotmail days. So apparently you can just click, I forgot my password, and they just get you to change it. Like it has such minimal security, right? They just send you an email saying, someone tried to change your password. <laughs> someone changed your password. And that's it. Then once you've already changed it and gotten into the account, you can be like, cool. Now I'll uh, just confirm that it was me changing the password. So yeah, someone's done that. Use that to get to my Discord and just say, I don't remember the password on Discord, so Discord sent the email to the Microsoft account they'd just taken. Um, they've then gone into the Discord and changed the email account attached to the Discord, so I can't log into it, because I don't know what email account is attached to it anymore. Um, and then they've gone and charged Nitrox fees and drained my account. Now, this is all stuff that will blow over. This is all stuff that you know, can be reversed. My bank immediately caught it and was like, hey, someone's just tried to steal all your money. We put a block on your account and we're investigating the charges. So it'll probably come back. It will come back or else I'm going to go burn Discord HQ down. Um, the only thing that's going to take time is Discord fucking responding to me to give my account back. Now, as I am the original email holder, well, as I'm the email holder of the original account, or that was originally on the account, they'll give the account back. No issues. Um, it's just a matter of Discord actually fucking replying, which they have not. I'm in the process of moving to the other side of the country. I think I did the equivalent for the American folks. It's like going from uh, LA to South... Dakota, I don't know, whatever's just above Florida, one of them. <laughs> like, that that's roughly the distance slash trip size of my move. Uh, so, fortunately, my account is already nice and empty, or was nice and low before all this, so they've only taken a few hundred dollars and hasn't actually stopped my move. I've already paid for everything. Uh, but it is just the most frustrating thing. Very, very displeasing. Um, but yeah, Dan Dupe, that was hilarious. Okay, I, I did, someone was kind enough to send me the GIF. Uh, that was funny. Um, but no, I, it's, I do want to just address that I didn't click any suspicious links. I'm not that kind of moron. Uh, I'm just the kind of moron that doesn't update emails when I, like, don't use them. <laughs> so, I, I just, it's just, you know, that's the account that has just sat there being forgotten for the last 10 years or so, probably more. Um, so yeah, that's what my Discord is tied to. When I get it back, I'll update it to my actual, like my current email address that has like the two-factor authentication and all that other bullshit on it that can't be logged into without my phone being sent a text message. Um, that'll stop this happening again. So guys, that that's that's my little bit of advice. Don't use Microsoft emails, man. And if you have an old Microsoft email, don't be like, ah, it's unimportant. I thought it was. I thought it wasn't attached to anything other than my Xbox account, uh, but apparently it is attached to Discord. Um, but fortunately, the only credit card or anything attached to my Xbox account is my dad's. He'll let me know if there's any charges there. Uh, no, no, I'm pretty sure that's all rounded or square. Uh, I have got uh, authentication apps through that old email address now. As I said, I hadn't touched it. I had to, like, change the password just to get in, which, again, it doesn't require any, like, security clearance. You just be like, hey, I forgot my password. Well, my password doesn't work because some cunt changed it. Um, yeah, I'm back in on my email account. Changed all the stuff I needed to. Um, and now I've pretty much just got these monitors to pack. Everything else for the PC's done. 
Oh, a couple of boxes. <sighs> it's been a stressful day. My temper is not doing well. And... I'm going to just leave it at that. Thanks for your time, guys. Thanks for your patience. At least someone's got some left. Um, but yeah, no. Obviously, don't click suspicious links, but anyone with half a brain cell knows that. Just the more important warning is... Yeah, watch out for those old Microsoft emails. They suck. <laughs> that was like a different time in the internet. Um, I was supposed to go pick up $50 worth of Hot Wheels cards, which I sent pictures in collections on the Discord. And it was a lot for $50, right? I was legitimately on my way to go pick these up. And I was, they were like, oh, I want cash. And I was like, I'll stop by an ATM. And the ATM was like, insufficient funds. And I was like, that ain't right. Why is it insufficient funds? Uh, and yeah, it was this. Um, they took a little more than my $50. So I don't get those cars now, which sucks because it was a lot of cars and tracks. It was like, I'd say probably close to two or $300 worth of stuff. Um, and I was getting it for 50 bucks. It was going to be really nice to do like the, the opening. I was going to do an opening uh, as a phone video of me you know, going through all the cars, seeing what cars they were, hopefully find something nice. Uh, but no, instead I'm doing this video where I'm sweating because I've locked myself in this room to record a video and uh, I'm just broke and sad and viscerally angry. Um, for those who haven't been little shitheads, um, thank you for your support. <laughs> um... Look, worst case, um, Shuby has now made a backup of the server because he's an absolute angel. Uh, so I don't think that they care about doing anything to my server. It's not malicious or anything. They're from Russia, so I don't think I have any enemies in Russia. Um, so it's just people just trying to skim money out of my account. Uh, to my knowledge, no one has been sent a link from my account, so they're not trying to get, they're not trying to use my account for anything to, like, get to other people. Um, which, you know, they could have, like, been real clever and sent out a thing being like, here's a new video, guys, or here's a new update on the season, um, and someone would have clicked it, but they're not that clever. Uh, so if my account does send a link, please let me know through, uh, Twitter, <laughs> not, this is the only way to contact me now, uh, or Shuby. Shuby's pretty in touch with me. He's good. Um, so, yeah, hopefully this all gets resolved. I'm just kind of rambling here. I feel like there's something I'm forgetting. Um, yeah, worst case, if I can't get my account back, I'll have Shuby uh, contact Discord for permission to own the server, and he'll just take the server. We just boot the old account, um, and I start fresh not the end of the world it's just really annoying because there's some you know discord friends i would probably lose forever um but some of them i might be able to find again just see how we go <sighs> anyway soup and toast for dinner because you know i haven't got money for real food <laughs> Uh, no, that's not it. I'm on soup and toast because I was vomiting all day yesterday. Like, oh my god, can't catch a break. I've got to move in less than a week, and I've been sick, and I've been robbed, and I've lost my Discord account, and I got, I missed out on cheap Hot Wheels cars. Not my week. So, any Australian plane crashes this weekend, you know I'm on them. <laughs> 